In this video, let's implement the primary key based operations in our employee detail class. All right. So far, we have this listing down the employees and creating the employees. But here we will actually use generics dot retrieve API view. This will actually allow us to retrieve a single object from the database. And it is very simple. It will also take the query set just like how we used to give the query set right so here also it will take the query set employee dot objects dot all and it will also take serializer class which is employee serializer all right and now because this is a primary key based operation we want to specify the attribute lookup field okay lookup field is equal to based on what we want to search for the data right based on what we want to take out the data from the database right based on primary key we want to fetch the data right so that's why we should specify lookup field equal to pk all right based on the primary key it will give you the object now only this much is enough to get you the data from the database based on the primary key okay so and now let's go back and test our endpoint so here I will pass 5, I'll pass ID 5 and you see we got the employee detail of the ID 5. Okay, so but here you see we don't have any update functionality and we don't have the delete functionality, right? So that is because we have only passed retrieve API view here. If you want to update, you see generics dot update API view and the moment you pass this here you know you will get the form here with the pre-populated data so you can edit it here okay Joe you okay, simply say a and you see update is done right and if I say one and you see we have the data of the primary key one and you can update it from here and the next one we need to test is the delete one. So for deleting the data, you should simply say generics dot destroy API view, right? Destroy API view and uh, it will allow you to delete this object. Okay, you see the delete button. Okay, so I will actually go ahead and go to five and I'll delete it you see once the once it is deleted we have 204 no content and again we are using three api views right but as you know we have the combination of api views right so instead of using three api views separately we can simply use generics dot retrieve update destroy view okay so this will take care of all the functionality at once right if you pass this and you refresh and you have everything right let me go back and let me test four i think we don't have four we have six okay you see we still have delete we still have the update form and we have this data as well so that's how you use the generics to perform simple crud operations now you can see we have further reduced the lines of code by using generics all right